miles of traffic and four hours of inconvenience. This is the torment motorists face today as scrap iron workers blocked both sides of the Solomon Ho Choi Highway near Point Pier and Claxton Bay around 4 a.m. The burning will continue. It will not stop. It will not stop until we get into some, speak to somebody in authority. Among those inconvenienced was the Vivian family who were trying to catch a flight bound for the United States. This morning we go into the airport. We thought we would have been early, an unnecessary expense. That is what it will be and it's about eight or nine people. Police cleared the debris after 9 a.m., but their actions drew condemnation from the Prime Minister who said, quote, what a wonderful idea of leadership from Roger and the followers, including the UNC. The marauding gangs of metal thieves threatened to, but did not complete the job of shutting down the country. So the leaders are helping them to get that done. But the scrap iron workers had a message for the Prime Minister. Somebody come and talk to us in some authority. Come and speak to us. We is not beast. They defended their decision to block the highway, saying their families are suffering. They never gave us a chance to say, well, look, Christmas coming, school opening. Nice give all a little chance, give you a little month, a little two months to let we accumulate a at little least, money at least. so that we could maintain we family for the time that they say they want right. to shut it down for. Right. What are we supposed to do now? But they made no apologies to the motorists caught in the gridlock. We suffering too. And this is a minor inconvenience in, the, in what we face in. This is a very minor, and if they could go on like that for a minor inconvenience, imagine for us. So it's not as we that affecting us, everybody in the community. You understand? And if they may get him something, how do they give us? You understand? You can... So why we had to feel We just ask him so we walk back. The Scrap Iron Dealers Association and the Joint Trade Union Movement have all distanced themselves from the highway blockade. Radicadi Silver, CNC3 News.